we start off this video uh, tutorial on how to put your PC screen onto your TV, I'd like to make a quick shout out to one of my Xbox friends, Miss Solby. I love you, I'm glad that we're friends, and I can't wait to talk to you again, so there's your shout out. I'm going to show you guys uh, how to set up your computer screen onto your TV screen. This is for people out there kind of like me who likes to uh, you know, play games on your PC and put them on your TV like when I used to play uh, World of Warcraft or RuneScape or something like that. So um, you could also do videos like YouTube videos, you can do Netflix, all that great stuff. So um, how to do this? The reason you guys have probably looked at this and like, oh look at that, he's got a little mini dildo. No, it's a flashlight because I need to get out behind the TV and show you guys something and because the lighting is so crappy in my basement you wouldn't be able to see it so right here we have a try to grab it a cable right here I cannot remember what it's called but it costs about 27 35 uh, to 30 dollars at Radio Shack it's a GigaWare brand and it's in the section called RGB PC um, I don't know what RGB stands for but I know that when it says PC, it's for your PC. And here is a uh, audio dual-sided male uh, cord. The video jack is female ends, both sides. And remember that, because that'll be really important, because you don't want to get the wrong ones. So, I have these both six feet long, so I can at least get around my TV and to my computer. So let's get to the computer. Uh, I'll leave that on like right there so you guys can see a little bit. Oh. Now, on the computer, you will you need to have one of these jacks, which is the male end that goes to this uh, jack. If you don't have it, you're going to have to find an adapter. Um, if you're on a Mac, you're probably going to be the one to need to find an adapter. They're very expensive. Um, I do have one. I don't know where it is, and I don't use my Mac that much, so I say screw it. Windows is better for when you're doing this, so sorry Mac users, but you're going to have to figure this out on yourself. So without further ado, you take the uh, female end and you plug it into the male end on your computer. Don't worry about if you have these screws on it and you don't have screws on your computer. That's completely fine. So let's plug that in. You know what would help is if I had it in the right way. Okay, now that's plugged in. Next thing you're gonna need to do is get the audio playing because all you have right now is video from that cable right there. So, to get audio, you need to plug it into your headphone jack. You uh, Probably most of the time, you're gonna have two um, jacks that this will fit in. You wanna get the one that has a little headphone symbol next to it because the other one's an input, this one's an output. So, you plug it into the output. Good. Great. Grand. Now, let's give you guys a quick demonstration. Okay, so now we have everything plugged in, as you can see. And it's on my TV. To get the correct channel for this, you need to find the channel that says RGB, PC, RGB, PC, or PC. Uh, there could be a different name for it. I don't know, but it's going to be the single uh, exclusion out of the bunch that are similar things like uh, AV component and HDMI. For all I know it could say penis, who cares? But it's gonna be the exclusion out of the bunch, so remember that. So, um, I'm gonna use Halo Combat Evolved as a demonstration. So, um, usually I'd be doing this with a capture card, but this is just a quick video, so it doesn't really matter. So let's let this load up. If any of you guys want to know about prices, the uh, audio cable, which is the little thing that you can fit into an iPod, those tiny little things, was, uh, I believe, $7, and the um, cable for video was like $28 to $30. It's a little bit more expensive, but you know what, it's worth it, especially those people out there like that, or like me, that would play RuneScape or um, Halo, for example. Uh, or even World of Warcraft. I, I used to play it and I probably will be getting back into it just because this will be such an awesome experiment, experience. 
So I'm just going to continue. This is how I tested. Um, I am really kind of like one handed right now, so it really can't do too much. But just to show you guys a quick response time, it's pretty. It's actually like instant response, so there's no land time. Perfect for gamers out there that want to get their PC on their TV. So. Uh, I really appreciate you guys viewing my video. I hope you, this helped you guys out because I was looking for videos on how to do this myself. And I finally figured it out, so I figured I'd help the others out there that wanted to do this. So, thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Noxgate8, signing off.